Hello dear children, I welcome you once again in your GK video class. Children, as you all know, we have completed yesterday computer safety. Okay, now today's class topic is animals in films. Okay, so today date is, today's date is 10th July. 2021 and this is class 2 general knowledge class okay children so here you can see 10th July class 2 and this is your general knowledge class and our topic for today is animals animals in films now children i would like to ask you or i must believe that you all must have seen some movies which are based on animals and the main character of the film you must have seen animals just like Stuart Little, Appu Raja, Hati Mere Sathi these type of the films only and only based on the animals character and these characters were very famous that time so children and these type of the films only made for the children so children we are going to talk about these films and these character which are become very famous after the releasing films okay so these are the movies we are going to discuss first then we will discuss about the characters okay now children let's start our class match the following animals with the films they starred in so first is dunstan checks in marmadicude 101 dalmatians babe pig in the city marley and me and f is stuart little so children we have to match it with this character which animal played the role or main role in these films so children we are going to solve this exercise first then i will tell you in detail about that i will go you some uh, images and i will show you something which is inside that films so here you can see first picture if you will see that is pig okay and this pig you can find in d number that is baby pig in the city okay so this pig one number is pig is there so we will the pig played important role or you can say main lead role in this film so that is why the film name is babe babe pig in the city okay children babe pig in the city children okay now we are moving to the second number that is little sweet mouse here you can see this is mouse now mouse had played role very important role and the picture is titled on that particular animals that is Stuart little okay in that movie you can see a white color of 
mouse is there and he played a wonderful role okay so this is number 2 if you will see that is mouse and stuart little the movie name is stuart little stuart little okay now we are moving to the number 3 number 3 if you will see there is a dog very cute dog number 3 on number 3 you can see this is a dog so so dog played in the film that is marley and me marley and me so number 3 is marley and me marley and me okay now number 4 you can see here one chimpanzee is there okay so the chimpanzee you can see in film the played role that is dunston chicken dunston chicken okay so he played a very important role that is dunston now children this is number 4 you will write dunston dunston the film name is dunston checks in children dunston checks in okay okay this is the film name movie name now we are moving to the fifth number children so first you complete this or take a screenshot okay now we are moving to the next one the next one is number 5 number 5 you can see another dog you can see this dog is there and this dog worked in uh mar medicu marma duke okay marma duke in fifth number is matched with mama mama duke marma duke okay mama duke okay mama duke okay now at six marma duke is a 2010 american live action film adaptation of brad ederson comics strip of the same name okay children so this is mark maduke okay the film centers on a rural kansas family and their pets a great dane named marmaduke voiced by own wilson and his best friend a balinese cat named carlos as family relocates to orange country california and has to face the challenges of starting a new life the film was released on june 4th 2010 and was met with largely negative reviews but because the plot was wonderful so that is why that film done has done big business now children i am going to read the story of this marmaduke or you have to see what is inside this story marmaduke is a great dane living in the rural Kansas with his best friend who is a cat named Carlos his owner Phil works as a marketing director for a dog food company Phil is very strict with Marmaduke his wife is Debbie 
and they have three children Brian Barbara and Sara one day Carlos tells Marmaduke that he overheard Will saying that they were being transferred to orange country he later goes to a dog park where he meets on the overconfident chinese crested name gypsy a toy boyish australian shepherd name mezi a wise dachshund name raisin and a beautiful rough collie named jezebel whose boyfriend is bosco a tough and callous buke seren with two miniature pincher minions named thunder and lightning later that night marmaduke and the mutts get together at night and crash bosco pedigree's only party only to be scared away marmaduke asks mezi to help him get a girl whom she presumes is herself but is jezebel okay children so this is the plot of this movie now children marmaduke takes jezebel on mezi dream date which the later watches after afar while the winslow family are on the don's bed boat marmaduke throws a party most residents of the dog park attend save for mezi gypsy and raisin bosco crashes the party after the discovering that carols lives with marmaduke and the winslows he exposes marmaduke who loses his friends when the winslow return and phil discovered the house in a wreck he locks marmaduke outside marmaduke runs away and leaves mezi a toy she had given him earlier mezi goes to the marmaduke house and the carlos tells her that he left the house as he looks for him marmaduke meets chupadogra a wise elderly english mastiff who is feared for presumably eating his owner in reality he ran away to lead a pack but they abandoned him he has stamped the time alone in the woods with nothing but a blanket and his old water bowl with reeds buster buster tells mark madu to return to his family while he still has one and distracts a dog catcher marmaduke leaves but get gets lost the next morning family discovered the marmaduke is missing and begin searching for him mezi and the family find him at the same time on his street but mezi falls into the subterranean rainwater conduit after the street below her collapses marmaduke jumps in after her and phil tries to retrieve him as well as the fire department the fireman saves mezi but loses marmaduke in the raging water by this time phil has been fired for some missing uh, the meeting for the last chance with petco so he then runs to the advocate and the conduits leads to his fine marmaduke in the raging water he begs marmaduke to let go to the branch of his holding on to the let the water carry him to fill he reluctantly does and is saved several kids get that on a video and put it into youtube since it generate almost 7 700 hits 7000 Uh, 700 hits phil is rehired phil that talks about moving back to the kansas and um, here you can see but the entire family wants to stay in california marmaduke later comforts the pedigree 
said that difference shouldn't matter that they are all dogs and should have an equal share of the park everyone agrees and turned to the bosco uh, who leaves after revealing the fear of bees which marmadukes also afraid of the meanwhile the youtube also wins the company the pet codile phil and don begin thinking of his commercial when they ask each other about it dogs and could talk to each other so this is how the final finale that shows marmaduke carlos jezebel mezi gypsy raisin thunder lightning and the buster among others dancing and singing what i like about you which turn out to be the commercial in the end the marmaduke and the mezi are dating marmaduke and jezebel are friends and all is well marmaduke then rips as in the bed as he winks at the camera so that is how the film is completed and it was wonderful movie of marmaduke okay children now we are moving to the next movie that is 100 101 dalmatians so 101 dalmatians it is a species of dogs that is spotted actually they are having a white uh, a body and on their body they are having uh, spots okay so 101 dalmatians i'm going to tell you about this story now here you children 101 dalmatians 1996 film 101 dalmatian is a 1996 american adventure comedy film the film is a live action adaptation of the walt disney 1961 animated film of the almost the same name itself an adaptation of the dodi smiths 19 56 novel the 100 and the dalmatian directed by stephen herrick and co-produced by john hux okay children so here it is i am going to tell you the story about this or you can say the plot about this film american video game designer rosa dearly lives with his pet dalmatian pongo in the london One day Pongo um sets his eyes on a female dalmatian named Perdi after a frantic chase uh, through the street of the London that ends in St James Park Rosa discovered that Pongo likes Perdi her owner Anita Campbell Green falls in love with Rosa when they met they both fall into the lakes as a result of their dogs chasing each other but they return to the roser home and anita accept his proposal they get married along with pardi and the pongo and here the story begin anita work as a fashion designer at the house of the devil Okay children her boss the pampered and very glamorous Krula Devil has a deep passion for fur doing so far as to have a taxidermist Mr Skinner skin a white tiger at the London Zoo to make it into a rug for her Anita inspired by her dalmatians designs a coat made with spotted fur Krula is a intrigued by the idea of making garments out of the actual dalmatians and finds it amusing that it would seem as it if she was wearing anita's dog stuart little a very famous story this is the story about little family who adopt a charming young mouse named stuart but the family cat wants rid of him in new york city you would come across a small house 
home to a family known as the Littles. You would happen to think of them as the nicest family you would never ever meet. One day, Frederick and Eleanor, both parents and Littles, go to and the orphanage to find a brother for their son. George, while at it, they meet Stuart, a small but charming mouse, who apparently inhuman civilized. They adopt him, and everyone, even George, loves him. But there is one problem with Stuart life. Snowbell, the little family cat, who wants him, but when trouble start up almost immediately, Stuart must make it back to his home before Snowbell's friend find out about him. When the little family go in search of the younger adopted boy, they stumble upon a young mouse like child named Stuart. Being smart and kind, Stuart is immediately welcomed into the family, much to his new brother George's disapproval. However, family cat Snowbell takes a sudden disliking to the steward and teams with the gang of alley cats in the conspiracy of getting rid of it. <coughs> a movie based on the story by children's author about a mouse who is adopted by the little family and is adventurous trying to become an accepted member of family. He fights to gain his brother's affection and to stay which is against the family's cat wishes. So this is beautiful movie and this is the image of Stuart Little. Now children, our next movie is Babe Pink in the Pig in the City. Babe Pig in the City is a 1998 comedy drama film and the sequel to the 1995 Babe it is co-written, produced and directed by George Miller, who co-wrote and produced the original film. Most of the actors from the first film reappeared as their respective roles, including James Cromwell, Miriam Margolis, Hugh Joe Weaving, etc. Most of them have only brief appearances, as the story focuses on the journey of Babe and the Author Arthur Hoggett's wife Esme in the fictional city of the metropolis and Elizabeth Daly replaces Christine Kavong as a babe. The film nominated for Best Original Song at the 1998 Children. Both the first films Babe and the sequel Babe Begin City were filmed entirely in Australia. The majority of the animals in the film were housed in specially designed facilities at the Fox Studios where most of the sets were built. The remaining animals were housed in Robston which was Australian location of the Hoggart farm. So this is a wonderful story and uh, it is moved around this pig. Now here you can see children, many characters, dog, different kinds of dogs you can see with this pig. So all of the dogs in the film that were found in the animal shelters found homes with the cast and the crew. According to the Royal Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals and the Animal Strainer, no animals was harmed in the making of this film. So this is a wonderful story about animals okay children now we are moving to the next movie that is Marley and me the next movie name is Marley and me Marley and me the puppy years is a 2011 American direct to DVD comedy film and the prequel to The Marley and Me 2008. The film was directed by Michelle Damon and written by the Damon and his wife 
Jenny Damon. The film was released on DVD on June 1st, 2011. As the title suggests, the film is about Marley in his puppy years. Marley and his owner, Body Grogan, uh, causes trouble at the local dog contest. Unlike the original film, however, Marley is given a speaking voice, voiced by the Grissel Russell. So Marley is a puppy and according to the some people, he is the world's worst dog. While taking care of the Marley, Body Grogan has to stay with his grandfather, Fred Grogan, uh, because his mother, Carol, is in the business trip. So the body stays with the Marley in his grandfather's house. His grandfather is strict and about chores and the pushes him around a lot. One day while on a walk with the Marley body on his sta- skateboard, body meets a girl named Casey. They chat for a while and the Casey tells him about a puppy championship. Casey, whose parents own a pug rescue center, enters three of her pugs in the contest so she can get money for the center. She tells Body to enter Marley in the contest, but according to the rules, a team must have three dogs. So Casey tells Body about the Mrs. Crouch, who has two other lab puppies, named Crucia and Moose. Together, all three of them trained for the course. Meanwhile, elsewhere, Hans von Weisbettler is a being cruel to his three puppies, Turbo, Lesil, and Axel. He puts voltage collar on them. If they are not behaving the way he wants, they get shocked. His three puppies were last year's puppies champions. So, Hence, wanted to make them even better. So the day before the competition, Body sends him pups for a day at the spa. But after the pups finish, a man wearing a spa worker's uniform takes them, along with the Australian shepherd dog, Dundi, who was also part of the competition. The evil man in the hanker, Hans' assistant. He locks the four of them away from his two big German Shepherds, Trouble and Chipper, who were pretending to eat the pups. The pups get scared, but the Shepherds say that they were only messing with him, with them. They help the pups escape by using a seesaw with the hair with which the pups made. One pup would be one side while one of the shepherd would jump into the other so that the pups would fly away. All four escape and return to the body's home. So this is a very interesting story about pups. The next in the championship start, everyone does well, but in the middle, Marley gets distracted. When the prizes are announced, body is the upset because he did not win. Initially, Hans was in the first place, but Marley saves the day. A cat named had snips all the handstock collars. Then Marley takes one collar and puts in the hands pocket. When the pups don't obey, Hans turns the collar on, getting on the electric shock himself, he remote, which controlled the collars, falls out of the pocket and the judge see it. He is hands disqualified. The new result are first place for the Australian dog and the second place for KC Pugs. Because Marley saved the day, Body gets a prize for the good sportsmanship. Body in the middle of the competition saw his mother and was surprised his mother, who thought Body was irresponsible, sees that he is happy with Marley. He couldn't keep Marley because it was his relative's dog. However, the three dogs who belongs to Hans are not his anymore. One family adopts Lisa and Axel, but the Turbo, the last one, was going to be taken to the dog shelter to find a home. Body's mother said he could keep him because she believed Body was ready to own a dog. 
So, this is the story of this Marley and May. So, children as we have discussed about many films as in Mar Marmaduke, 100 Dalmatians, Babe, Pig in the City, Marley and Me, Stuart Little, these are the wonderful films or movies which were made for the children. So children, we, uh, in next chapter, we will study about um, treasure hunt, okay children. So we will meet again, till then, bye bye and take care.